What's going on guys? Billy Rains here and I wear my t-shirts inside out. Uh, now that I've said that, you may not be able to see, you might be able to see that my shirt's inside out. Anyway, in today's video, we're going to be talking about what's the worst road I've ever been on. And secondly, we're going to be talking about a little story about something that happened at a customer. So let's talk about it. So as you can see from the title of the video, today's video we're gonna be talking about what is the worst road I've ever driven on. And believe me guys, we're gonna to get to that. Uh, before I do, I'm gonna tell you a little story about the customer that I am currently at. And also, I'm gonna ask you real quick to just slide on down here and uh, hit this like button down here. And if you haven't subscribed, try subscribing. We make great probably best videos on youtube probably i don't know i don't watch every single video on youtube but i'm pretty sure mine are the best um also for the comment of the day let me know down in the comment section below what is i mean if you're a trucker or if you're anybody what's the worst road you've ever driven on sorry if i'm a little off today i was um at a date last night and um i was up kind of late but um t is what it is you know what man i'm not liking that i'm not liking that audio quality i'm not liking it so i'm gonna turn my truck off and i'm gonna suffer through this heat just for you guys but anyway i'll get to my story about the customer so i get here and i go to check in and when i walk in you know i didn't notice it at first but not a single person in there was wearing a mask some of them had beard covers but no masks in the entire place right so i walk in it takes this guy he takes one look at me and he goes to his cabinet he gets a mask and he makes me put he makes me put the mask and what he tried to make me put the mask on he handed me that mask i threw it on the ground i was like hey man i don't believe in your i don't believe in your uh chinese virus i don't believe in it so i'm not wearing your mask um and i told him off i was like you know i should have told him i was vaccinated but no, he tried to give me that mask and um, I was like, no, man, I'm not wearing it. I gave him a piece of my mind. I'm just kidding. He gave me the mask and I put it on and I checked in. But I thought it was bullshit, man. I thought it was real bullshit that they made me wear a mask. Nobody else was in there was wearing a mask. I almost, hey, look, I was this close to giving them a real, like a real piece of my mind, but I didn't. Uh, I kept it cool and... Um, but that close that close to just like yeah man it is really getting hot in here uh, I'm doing so many takes like I said I'm a, I'm a little uh, tired today um, but we're going to get through it together guys and gals uh, it's hot out here and we're didn't like the audio quality but so I was coming up here and I was on this road called 69. I'll pause for laughter there. 69. US Highway 69. It was um that that signs on the road that said 69 on them. Um but so there's a stretch of 69 around uh Eufaula, Oklahoma that is the worst stretch of road I've ever driven on so you might be like hey Billy I've never been on US Highway 69 what makes this such a bad road to be on well A you're in Oklahoma, which is terrible. Um, B, so they're doing construction. So they've got it closed down to just one lane going each way, right? And one of the lanes is literally like boxed in with like barriers. So God forbid anything ever happens there. It could be absolutely catastrophic. Uh, but I was driving down it today. It's a super rough road. 
Um, and and what what really what really got me going about U.S. Highway 69 was um, while I was driving on it, I noticed that this road was paved with no less than five or six different paving sources. So there was like there was like the road, which was like a slab. So they had like two slabs to make this road. And then it was like they built, they were like, well, we need a shoulder. So then they extended it a little bit for a shoulder. And then they were like, well, that's not enough shoulder. We need some more shoulder. So then they paved even more shoulder onto the side of that shoulder. So that's three different pavements. And then they were like, man, this road is terrible. Where the slabs meet, there's cracks, which are causing potholes. So they were like, well, we already used these three different kinds of paving. We have to find a fourth one for these potholes. So then they pave all these potholes with with uh, different paving things than what they were already using. And it's like they came in like five or six years later. And they're like, shoot, we have even more potholes. So let's pave it with even more different kinds of paving stuff to where it's like five or six different kinds of surfaces that you're driving on. Not to mention like, you're in Oklahoma, which is terrible. And I don't mean to alienate any part of my audience. If you live in Oklahoma, I'm sure that you think that Oklahoma is great and that's cool, but it's Oklahoma and the road's rocky. And this was, I was going north down. I'll be going south down later. There's like a part of the road where it like curves in and then like goes this. And it's like, I'm surprised more people don't rock their shit on this section of road. Because it literally just like goes real quick like that. But yeah, so U.S. Highway 69 is my, in Oklahoma in the Eufaula area, not Eufaula, Alabama, Eufaula, Oklahoma. It's um, the worst highway that I've ever, ever driven on. Sorry, I had to, I had to turn the um, truck back on. It's way too hot and honestly, having the truck off didn't make the audio that much better. Maybe I need to give me some kind of fancy audio board for my truck or something like that. I don't know. Uh, but anyway, I appreciate you guys. Use guys. Who am I? Like Tony Soprano? Hey, what's going on, guys? But anyway, like I said, um, I was driving down the road and I thought of that about the worst roads and it got me thinking. And you know, I like hearing what you guys say. So if you guys have a worse road you want to put down in the comments, maybe we can talk about it. But for me, uh, U.S. Highway 69 is like the worst road I've ever driven on. Um, and I'm sure I've driven on worse. Um, I remember Michigan being pretty bad. And uh, Louisiana is pretty terrible. But for like just a, just like a little couple mile stretch you follow Oklahoma on on US Highway 69 is is probably the worst to me uh, but yeah so hopefully you enjoyed that let me know down in the comments what the worst road to you is if hit the like button if you don't mind uh, today's a great day guys like I said I had a date last night with a girl that was awesome um, uh, crypto money butt coin all that is going through the roof um that's a little inside joke for me and jake terry uh you guys can just forget about that if you want to um and uh the whole mask thing it's been a good video guys i've, I've really enjoyed talking to you guys getting getting down in the comments and getting down sorry i've been putting my videos out more quickly i'm getting back into it thinking about starting doing daily vlogs again trying to kind of build up a little bit of a buffer so i can try to get them done um 
You still don't know how interesting that'd be. But hey, I keep thinking there's no way anybody would ever watch a little country boy from Texas who's out here trying to make it in this in this world. I, I you know I never thought that I'd ever have anybody watching these videos. And man, we're up to 2,600 and some change subscribers, and none of that's possible without you guys. Sorry about the getting uh, unloaded right now. Uh, man, I am so terrible at making videos. I appreciate you guys watching me, man. I don't even know what I'm doing here. Three years and we haven't gotten any better. We're still just using an iPhone and iMovie to make videos. What a world we live in. But uh, that'll about do it for this one. Sound check, sound check. Sound check. <clears throat> Just some good old boys Never meaning no harm Beats all you ever saw Been in trouble with the law Since the day they was born Seriously though, if you guys stuck around for this whole video Seeing that sweet little transition I put in there If you guys appreciate any of that Or if you watch this whole video Obviously I did something right Please hit that like button Comment down below, question of the day What's your least favorite road? Subscribe if you haven't subscribed. Thank you guys so much. I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.